Justin Bieber shocked concert goers when he took the stage at the South by Southwest Festival in Texas. Take a look. As long as you love me, we could be starving, we could be homeless, we could be broke. Before belting out his hit, As Long As You Love Me, Justin Bieber dedicated the tune to his baby. But after his weekend in Texas with Selena Gomez, which by the way included a ton of PDA, it's safe to say he was talking about her. Girl, I'm in love with you. This ain't the honeymoon. Yesterday, the 20-year-old posted this steamy video, which was shot over the weekend. It features the former Flames heating up the dance floor, indicating their relationships on the mend. But the Canadian took it down hours later after what was no doubt a difficult day. TMZ posted a video of Bieber's Miami deposition regarding a lawsuit that claims he had his bodyguard assault a paparazzo. During the four and a half hour session, Bieber's beyond defensive, especially when asked about the stunning star. Have you ever Don't ask me about her again. Don't ask me about her again. Have you ever Don't ask me about her again. Don't ask me Don't ask me about her again. He later took to Twitter to quiet his haters, writing, We all have a right to defend ourselves, and you can't really argue with that. Still, it's strange that he deleted the dancing video. Maybe it has something to do with another new report that claims Gomez's family is far from thrilled about their reunion. Of course, time will tell if these two are really back on, but for now, it's good to see both singers back on stage after a hiatus. 2013 was a monster year for Taylor Swift, as evidenced by this latest report that puts her at the top of her class. Taylor Swift is the music industry's biggest money maker, this according to Billboard. Swifty took in almost 40 million bucks in 2013 thanks to a wildly successful tour and digital downloads. And get this, that number doesn't even include merchandising or sponsorship, which brought in another $10 million for the pop star. On Sunday, Swift palled around with Lord in New York City. And the next day, the royal singer was forced to face questions about the nature of their relationship. During a radio interview with the Kyle and Jackie show, the 17-year-old was asked if she was with her new BFF. After uncomfortable silence, the shock jocks quickly backpedaled, saying they didn't mean like Ellen. Lord, who has a long-time boyfriend, questioned if they were being homophobic, later adding, don't ever try it, it's not working. Sean Diddy Combs is ready to pony up a huge pile of money in a bid to become a media maven. According to reports, the rapper Ullen, Lord, who has a long-time boyfriend, questioned if they were being homophobic. The 44-year-old is looking to convert his station, Revolt TV, which currently has a 74 million household reach. And remember, you can weigh in on all your entertainment headlines. Just tweet us at Ant City.